And this is the shit that I can't stand. What's up, everybody? It's raining, as usual. And my villagers have gone dumb. So we're going to have to break this and get some of them into the other houses because they're basically smothering each other. I don't know how exactly, but they're smothering each other. And for some reason, they want to be out in the rain. So the moment this one gets locked up, they're done. No, go to the other one. No, go to the other one. No, stupid. Go to the other one. Go to this one. Look, the door's standing wide open. Come on, go to it. <sighs> fine, fine. You're gonna be a jerk. Get inside. That son of a bitch just jump off. Oh! Still can't get used to that. Alright, now they won't smother each other. <clears throat> so, let's do something real quick, because this is a getting annoying. Sound. Off. Okay. Oh. Oh. Silence. So golden. Alright, so let's go over what, we've, what I've been up to. If you haven't noticed, like I told you before, I was going to build the wall. I got the wall built. I still have to figure out a way to get up on the wall, but it's, uh, it's pretty much done. Um... I went one one block this time, uh, just because and it's pretty much all the way around. I'm not going to go all the way around. Uh, I don't like this right here, so I may lower this later on. I don't know. I also didn't add the side entrance anymore. I left it just kind of like that. For safety reasons, of course. So, oh, it's been raining like this for the past mm, three or four Minecraft days. Um, I still get jittery because I swear to God there's a zombie zombies in here but this place is lit up like a Christmas tree so there should be absolutely no way for a zombie to be in here anyways uh, I'm, pro I'm gonna have to move the well obviously uh, though underneath this is, is a small ravine so I don't know I'll figure that out um, pretty much none of the buildings have changed I did go mining which I'll go to that real uh, here in a second um, freaking enderman uh this horse just wandered in by himself for no apparent reason so i guess uh he and i are gonna be best friends right horse right i used to own a horse that color eh, i love you too anyways uh everything right now is in cobblestone the reason why is because cobblestone well you'll understand in a few minutes why i have so much cobblestone uh, but i did put the border fence around the dock area to reduce the zombie invasion uh, for some reason there's a whole bunch of them just mandering around you put some right here some right here one right here one right here put it right there oh, eh, it looks cry like crap we'll put it right there we'll put one right there just for safety's sake um so yeah so far everything's working out pretty good so I'm very pleased um, okay let's try this again since obviously I had some technical difficulties uh, my crash or mine crash minecraft decided to crash on me anyway so let's go down my wonderful deep hole herder, 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 herder. Um, and I did like I said before like I was gonna do I was gonna bull rush um, bull rush the uh the um zombie thing over there now the reason why i have it like this simply is because uh zombies can't break through trap doors so if i had a regular door there a zombie would break through and possibly kill me i need this come here me need you uh i cleaned up my inventory just in case now there's the spawner I know I've got torches here somewhere. There they are. Question is, is how to get to it without getting, without getting, mm, without getting caught. 
I think I can turn up my sound now because we're out of the rain. I kind of need the sound on because it helps me hear something comes from behind. So, yeah. Back. Okay. So, can I get... How close can I get before they actually start to spawn? I can't get too damn close. I know that. Okay. We've got one. we got two. Oh, boy. Okay. So, here we go. Nothing? Really? Seriously? You're just gonna let me walk in here and round you up, huh? Hmm. I'm not on peaceful mode, am I? No, I'm on hard. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Cool. All right. So <laughs> that was easy. Uh, I was expecting like a whole shit ton of them to come out out, but apparently I was wrong. Uh, I will be using this for a XP farm. Sometime sooner or later. Ooh, there's gold. Wait, am I using... Yeah. No, I'm using stone. I need, I need iron. Uh, anyways, let's look in the chest. Now, um, I do want to mention a couple things. I do have um, a couple of new mods on. Um, actually, you know what? That's a good idea. Let's do that. Save and quit. Let's see. Let's go to mods. Okay, so this is the cool part about the new 1.6 I like is because... Well, it, it was introduced in 1.5.2, but I just realized it was possible, but it's really cool to me. Anyways, um, so we got Ford, Forge Mod Loader, uh, recent version. Uh, we've got Too Many Items, Damage Indicator, Ren's Minimap, a Dungeon Pack, which is, uh, I viewed that, and it was like, that's a super cool thing, I'm going to try that. Uh, Mo Foods, which I have no idea about, but I was told was something I would like, uh, because it's more sophisticated, and it carries more, um... It has more variety of things you can do. Uh, more, so, more swords uh, and timber. So I do know that timber does not work with the... Uh, where is it at? Um, Mo Foods Plus mod. Uh, that doesn't automatically take them down. So yeah. Okay. Place like the world. Back to work. Okay. Alright, so back to work we go. Alright, so with that being said, this will be the first time I've opened this chest, so I have no idea what's inside of it, so cross your fingers and close your eyes, and here we go. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. So we got some wheat. That's nice. Two name tags. Hell yeah. Uh, this is the mo most more swords, so we got an Aquarius blade, plus four attack, and plus three attack. I wonder what the difference is between... I'll have to look it up. Some buckets, which is good. Iron, which is even. <laughs> and then this is what I want right here. That is going to be superb. Iron, uh, iron armor, awesome. All right, so now, um, of course, iron. I, I, I believe that you can you can't craft the armor anymore. You can saddle them, but you can't. You have to find them in dungeons and stuff. So I'm hoping to find another. Now I did go down that way, which basically. Uh, amounted to nothing, and uh, that's the way the old way to the old mine shaft. Let's get this open. Okay. So, uh, let's uh, now. Um, I took a chance here and dug straight down, and uh, actually, I kind of stopped at bedrock level, went up five, and this is the reason why I was able to get all the cobblestone. And make all the, make all of the, uh, the wall that you see. I haven't done anything like the diamond or the iron or anything like that, but I just wanted to go through because I was picking up uh, cobblestone only. Uh, I didn't want to waste. Uh, these were future ones. I didn't want to waste the opportunity to uh, get it done. But I'll go back and pick all this stuff up and do something with it uh, sometime later. Uh, but, anyways, so yeah, that's there's the cobblestone and whatnot. Um, so for this episode, I guess it was kind of like a, I wanted to show you the tour of the place, and we need to put uh, we need to start thinking exactly how we're going to plan out our workshop because once the workshop is complete, then we're going to be able to do a lot more different things. Um,